going to leave us on the wings for this falling leaf. Okay. So go ahead, don't, don't descend, just hold us up there, start slowing down now. Okay. It's a good heading right here, that way you won't go over those houses, there we go. So level your wings now, you're still slightly right wing down, just a little bit, there you go. Okay, so just hold us up here and remember, stick smoothly all the way back and up, happy feet. When do you start doing the happy Just at the buffet, you know, yeah, yeah it starts to buffet. It's mainly just to keep you from sticking too much, you know, sticking and holding too much rudder yeah. in one direction. If you need, because one wing is dropping more than the other, you can add a little bit more to the other yeah. side, you know, but you, it's supposed to keep your feet moving. There, see how much better that is? Yeah. Okay. Keep that stick back. Yeah. Okay, good. Ah, uh, yeah, let's recover. Different. Let's recover now. Okay, and start adding power now. Let's bring it back into about. Hey. It keeps it much more under control. Yeah, yeah. Let's turn back toward the power lines to the left. Climb. We're going to set up, we're going to do some of those incipient spins, okay? Okay. But just let's proceed on toward Mount Baker there over the power line. Just climb us on up. Yep. I want to get up to, you know, about 5,000 or so. Okay. Switch into the acro tank. Fuel flow is stable. We'll start, we'll do the first one with a left turn. Okay. Go ahead. Yeah, start the turn. I'm going to bring the power back. Now, you get your hand on the throttle so yep. you can recover with power when you need it, when I tell you. Yeah. Okay, now punch that. Let's start adding, smoothly adding left rudder. Uh-huh. And watch the nose accelerate. Just look straight over the nose yep. now. Don't look off to the left. Look straight over the nose. There it comes. Around. Let it come around. Now, recover. Northeast practice area, 5 Mike Mike's doing aerobatics over the power lines between Fall City and Carnation, 4,000, 6,000. Keep the turn coming to get us back over the power line. I don't want to drift out over the town there. Oh, that nose. There you go. Okay, good. We've already designated Mark for the driver tonight. Okay, I'm going to start bringing the power back, start a right-hand turn. Okay. Establish about a 45 degree bank. Power to the back. Going home, one way or another. Okay, your choice on this one, either inside or top, bottom or top rudder. Okay. Remember now, as you start the maneuver, look straight ahead. Don't be looking off to yep. the side. The nose just stops moving. Yep. Get that stick back. Get that stick back. There you go. <laughs> now that's more like the you know incipient spin, surprise spin. Yeah. And then the deliberate one. Yeah, yeah. I was carrying a little bit more power that time, so it, you know it took a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. But you could see what happens if you had sort of a normal kind of traffic pattern power setting. Yep. And it you know even a 172 will come around like that if you let it. Yeah. So continue on this, and then once we're over the power line, aim us about Baker. Yep. And we'll do a regular spin here. Tell me what you're going to do. All right, we're going to start slowly reducing power. No, no. What kind of spin are we going to do? Oh, let's uh, do a spin to the right. Okay. How many turns? Two spins. Two turns. Two turns. Yeah. Okay. Bring the power back. Hold the nose up now so right. we can slow down and... and yep. So you don't find it a motel, does Slow down. Yep. Keep reducing power. Hold the pitch attitude. Slowly reduce the power to idle. As we get to the buffet, we're going to go full stick back. There's the buffet now, full right rudder. There's half a turn. I go for the uh, one turn. The ailerons are neutral. One and a half. Two turns. Full left rudder. The ailerons are neutral. Stop the spin. Neutralize rudder. Stick forward. Bring it back up. Let it fly. Bring the power back in. Very good. Turn left. Back over the power line. Excellent. So we lost about 2,000 feet. Yeah. That was very good. Now you can count Rainier's on this one. Okay. So uh, go ahead and aim us at Mount Rainier and tell me what you're going to do. All right, we'll do it to the left this time. Okay. To the variety. 
Two turns. Two turns. Okay. All right, so we're going to start bringing the power back to reduce our airspeed. Hold this pitch attitude for now. And try on this one to watch as the spin develops. Just sort of, you know, yeah. see, see what happens. Losing airspeed. Power back to idle. Bring the stick back. Left it, stick full back, left rudder. Half a turn. One turn. One and a half. Two turns. Full right stick. Taylor weather neutral. Stick forward. Pick it up. Bye. I gave it a little bit of rudder. I yeah, left it in a little bit too long. Yeah, you held the rudder a little too long. Yeah. But that was very good. You notice how the spin sped up a little bit after the one turn yeah, and yeah. stabilized. Once the nose pitches down, it stabilizes. The first half turn or full turn are kind of lazy comparatively. Yeah, let's, let's do our climbing left turn back toward Mount okay. Baker. And as we get through 6,000, we'll do this spin. And then after a turn and a half, I want you to push the stick forward just a little bit. You know, just okay. kind of neutral. Just kind of ease off on the stick. Leave the rudder and power alone, right? Okay. And we're just going to watch the acceleration. Then when it's recover time, so yeah. just watch that for about a half a turn or a turn. Okay. Then it's back to stick all the way back. Confirm power is idle. Okay. Opposite rudder. Recover the airplane, okay? All right. So just... Climb in here, we're looking for traffic. Everything looks good back here. Temps and pressures are good. Okay, bring the power all the way back. Power to idle. For the buffet. There it is, stick back, full left rudder. Half a turn. One turn. One and a half. Easy stick forward. Yeah, there's a full turn. Stick back. Yep. I left it in. No, you were pulling too hard. We got all those secondary stalls. Oh, yeah. That's all that, all that buffet was. Yeah, when, yeah. Whenever you feel that buffet, let, let ease off. Yeah, yeah. Notice how fast it sped up, though? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, whenever you feel that buffet, you've got to ease off on that stick. Yeah. I was thinking about my feet. Yeah. No, you got to keep your feet in the hands. Keep that, they both got to be yeah, they gotta, yeah, exactly. Yeah, you don't want to ease off on the rudder. You know, you want to keep that in to stop the spin. Yeah. But you got to get, you, if you're stalled, you're not going to recover. And we got about three or four secondary stalls there. I was thinking about... Um, after letting the nose forward to accelerate the spin, bringing the stick back to recover, and then I did bring it forward again. Uh, yeah. After stop. Yeah. It with the exactly. rudders. Yeah. But you can see why you want to get the rudder in first, not the stick, because that messes up yeah. your recovery. Yeah, It'd be yeah. very disorienting to you. It would speed things up, and you think, "Oh, I'm doing something wrong," and now you start trying to invent things to do. Right. Yeah. And then you're. Okay, on this one, we'll, uh, as we get up towards 6,000, I'll start bringing the power back. You will have all the controls. Okay. Then again, after a turn and a half, I want you to bring the power in about halfway, okay? Okay. Or we'll just want to keep the stick all the way back. Keep, keep the, the rudder all the way in. Okay. See what happens. And then to recover, power idle. Aileron's neutral. Yep. Opposite yeah, rudder. They're all stick forward. Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, okay. Keep going. We're at 6,000. I'm bringing the power back. Checking the, the, the instruments. Back. Not more than a third of the way. I Stabilize. Feel. Okay, you've got everything. All right. Hold it, bring the power back. To the left again. Yep. Yeah, don't let the pitch attitude the buffet. Yeah, Pull that rudder. Yeah, half. One turn. Yeah, one and a top. half. Bring the power in. Get power off. Power turn. back to idle. There you go. Easy. There you go. Yep. Cover, now power back in. So see what happened? It really sped up. Yeah, yeah. Okay, good.
That's why that pair sequence is important. You can lower the nose. We got plenty. Yeah. We just let off all our energy there. Uh, see, sorry. Okay, this time, what I want you to do is a roll and a half, which will take you to inverted, and then I want you to recover. You want me to show you one, or do you want to do it? You can try it. All right. Get the nose, remember to get the nose up and neutralize that elevator. Okay, you've got speed for this, so go ahead and try it. Okay. So pitch up, roll us one and a half times, so keep it coming around. Don't pull now, don't pull. Now recover. Now recover. There you go, excellent. You don't want to pull, you want to make sure you're unloaded. Yep. So that's more like a weak turbulence kind of encounter. Yeah. We'll try that again. Okay, you got 5,000 feet, airspeed's good, so pitch the nose up, okay. do a roll and a half and recover. Pitch up a little higher, there you go. Okay. Now, see how the nose drops? Yep. And recover, good. Bring the nose back on up. Good. You leave almost 500 feet that way. Yeah. I'll show you, I got the airplane, your airplane. It's tricky to, you know, during a multiple roll, the, tent, the nose tends to go down, but just hang on, I'll show you a little faster. Yeah. Yeah. I'll slow us down a bit. I'll show you a snap roll. Oh, great. Oh, horizontal spin. Yeah, yeah. Here we go. That's a little better. <laughs> <laughs> Did we do any calf cubans? I can't remember. No, we didn't. All right, I'll show you one, then you can try one. It's a good right. orientation maneuver. A little more speed here. We got good altitude. This is a classic reversal maneuver. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Look so left, just at the pitch. Yeah, just while you look straight ahead to make sure you don't dip a wing. Yeah. Now you check your wing. Now, just like a loop, we're coming yep. over the top. Lots of right rudder. There's Mount Baker. And now as we come down the backside, I stop it at 45. So I look up on my wing. Yeah, look straight ahead. And we roll upright. Yep. Let the airspeed build, and then bring it back up to level flight. If we were doing a big Cuban 8, we would just go back into the same maneuver. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right. So why don't you try one of those? There. Airspeed's good. Airspeed's good. Altitude's good. Everything looks good back here. All right. Pull up. Back Keep it coming. Right. Just like a loop. Keep pulling now. Ease it Relax off a little. It. Yeah, lots of right rudder now. Easy, easy. Let it fall. Let the nose fall. There's 45. Okay. Now, now roll. Try not to pull when you roll. Just roll it. There you go. So airspeed and it. then back up. Yep. Yeah, good. Let's do a uh, left 180. Okay. I'll show you, uh, I've got the airplane. Your airplane. I'll show you a reverse half Cuban. Okay. We're going to pitch up to 45. Yeah. Then I'm going to roll. I'll do one and a half rolls to invert it and then pull us through. There, yeah. I got a plane here just above the Cascades. Where is he? One o'clock, two o'clock? Yeah, about one o'clock. Which Going west to east, he's probably... I got down. it. He's no problem. Yeah. Okay, up we go to the 45. So I'm pitching up to 45, stomping the pitch, rolling one and a half times. One and a half, setting it. We're upside down. Look at Mount Baker out there. Yep. Climbing on this line, 80 knots through 5,500. Oh, I got all sloppy there. <laughs> I was looking for that airplane. Yep. Ooh. <laughs> now, did you feel the G effect there? Yeah. You really feel it because we were going negative and then we went positive. Yeah, so it's a bigger transition. That's right. Yeah. Why don't you try a slow roll? I'll talk to you through it, okay? All right. It's a good coordination exercise. We'll do it to the left. It's a little bit easier that way. So okay. pitch the nose up just like an aileron roll. Yeah. Now feed in left aileron, right rudder. Now you got to start pushing. Now left rudder, left rudder, left rudder, lots of left rudder. And bring it on around. Nice. Oh, yeah. That's neat. And pitch up. Yeah, pitch up. And then left rudder, right aileron, um, left aileron, right rudder, excuse me. Now push a little bit, good. And then the other rudder, you're wet it too much there. There you go. But not bad, bad. Not, yeah. not bad at all. Yeah. Those are hard to do well. Yeah. Let's finish up with a big old barrel roll. Okay. Uh, speed. So just good speed? A little, no, a little more. It's okay. Just a little bit. Be kind of a big victory roll for you. Yep. Pitch up to 45, pitch up to 45, and then just a tiny bit of aileron, keep the stick coming back. There and you go, keep it coming back. Easy, easy, easy. There you go. Nice and smooth now, try to keep it smooth. 
I see you got a little caddy yeah, up there. Yeah. Keep, keep it coming back up. Good. Okay. <laughs> I'll show you one. Here we go. All right. That airliner's no factor up at 10 o'clock. Yep. Here we go. We pitch up. And now we just roll. Tiny bit of aileron. You got to keep pulling though to keep it yeah, going. Right? Yeah. And you want to, you can sort of see how you're doing on your timing, right? Yeah. So we, ideally, we want to be right there. Yeah. And then pick it and up. And then pick yep. it up as you come around the other side. Yeah. And ideally, the wing should be level just as the nose hits the horizon. Yeah. All right, let's aim for both Bellevue. All right. Bring in the power back. Boeing Tower, extra 105, Mike, Mike, Bellevue, information, whiskey, landing. Helicopter 47 Sierra, disregard your report, landing at pad 6, we'll be at your own risk, wind, wind variable at 4. 47 Sierra, rest that, thank you very much. Number 105, Mike, Mike, Boeing Tower, and a right traffic runway, 31 right before Seward Park. Fort Seward Park, 31 right, 5, Mike, Mike. Number 592 Golf, Charlie, runway 31 left at Alpha 10, clear for takeoff, continue straight, I'll give you that frequency here in a little bit. Number five, Mike, Mike, traffic on a two-mile final for the big runway is a Cirrus, runway 3-1 right, clear to land. Clear to land, 3-1 right, five, Mike, Mike. I got the Cirrus out there. Yep. I have made, made a good landing on week. 119 or 0.2 out of the trade flight. 